Hey, welcome back, family. Uh, hope y'all are doing good. Um, I'm dropping some more heat. Uh, hopefully, y'all are having a good day. It's March 20th. Beautiful, uh, uh, sunny day out here in Texas. Hopefully, y'all are doing well once again. Uh, before I begin, I'm excited, but before I begin, I want y'all to hit that thumbs up, hit that like, that share, and that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. So that when I drop some more heat, and there will be more heat coming, uh, y'all be notified and be one of the first ones to watch the videos. But like I always say, please uh, uh, grow with me, walk with me, and uh, help this channel grow. And with that being said, I'm doing a shoe review of, um, you know, the Nike Cosmic Unity. There's three variants. The one I got on there, and they're on feet too, by the way. Uh, is a uh, Almo God. The ones I'm trying on and reviewing today is Almo God. And these released, I believe, on the 7th, March 7th. March 7th. And the other one, uh, the first one I released, and, and the dates are subject to change, is the uh, Cosmic uh, Unity. Uh, Green Glow. Those released February 26 of 2021. These Nike Cosmics, the ones that I'm wearing again, Alma God that I'm reviewing, uh, released March 7th. And uh, the one that the last variant is uh, the Space Hippie, Nike Cosmic Space Hippie, and those are set to release April 2nd. And uh, like I said, there's three variants. This is uh, one of the first, uh, uh, one of the Nike's first, you know, they're trying to go eco-friendly. Uh, you know, as you can see, we're outdoors. I mean, try to give y'all different locations each time, but uh, the beautiful trees, in other words, I did it outdoors because, you know, ecosystem. It's supposed to be uh, environmentally friendly. Uh, these shoes here. Uh, and I'll get a little bit more about the shoe as I go along, but I just wanted you to see them on foot uh, And my first reaction is that they feel comfortable they feel very lightweight and uh, You know they hug the shoe pretty good. They hug my feet pretty good and I like that and uh, these are very lightweight They feel very light. It feels like I'm just uh, Got some socks on and whatnot and so they feel good. They feel really good uh once again, you want to take a look at that. My camera, my little helper there. Uh, this material here is the fly net. All this stuff here, all around the midsole, on both sides, is called crater foam. And that's exactly what it feels like. Uh, now, the material is made out of 25%, at least, it says, 25% of recyclable goods. Um, and, uh, you know, is made out of sustainable materials, recycled rubber. Uh, it's got, like I said, it's got the foam, the crater foam. Uh, and the, one of the features is uh, it's got a full length zoom air swabble, uh, made in part by Recycle TPU. I don't know what TPU is, but y'all gonna have to look that up. And it's stitched directly to the midsole to help provide energy and uh, help you play. Uh, ball all day and feel fresh and I get wore out get get foot fatigue so that's pretty cool um, as far as comfortability they feel real good they feel real good on feet to be honest and I like the way they feel they feel very light uh, looks like you could uh, you know do some damage here on the court you know so uh, come follow me we'll do a quick review the box These are the box that came in. You know, uh, make sure you get all that. All the box that says move to zero is Nike's journey towards zero carbon and zero waste to help protect the future of our sport. So it's just a plain box. It's got some sayings. You know, like I said, uh, I think Nike's ahead of the game as far as, you know, uh, trying different things, different materials. You know be more uh, safer towards the environment and I think that's pretty cool let me know what y'all think about that uh, you know 
know, help uh, keep the environment clean and whatnot. So these retail at 160, uh, and I bought these online at Nike.com, but I'm sure you can find them at other retailers. Uh, so 160 is the price. They feel good. I think they're worth it as far as comfortability, and they're really light. Uh, many people might pass on these because of the colors. Not sure, but if you, I, I kind of like them. I kind of like the color schemes. You know, it's different. You know, it's, it's different. And like I said, it's made out of different materials. Um, and I think they're very worth it. Like I said, it's, it's got some stuff in there to, you know, stay fresh on your feet. If you pick up a couple of pickup basketball games at the park, uh, you know, you get tired after two or three games, you know, but these are supposed to help you. You know because they're light and whatnot and comfortable and very comfortable i will say that uh, comfortability i'll give it a 10. um now with that being said uh it's made out of all the midsole it feels like cardboard whatever crater is that's what this shoe is made out of crater uh foam throughout the midsole and even uh the tongue you can feel the tongue this feels rubbery right here uh, and that says cosmic you know that's a I kind of like the shoelaces uh, a different color that are rope kind but if you can see I mean it does feel like like foam here that's probably what makes the, the shoe light and uh, and I'm sure it's got some recyclable materials in there and it's got the fly knit all through here you know looks like a purple purplish bluish there uh, here around the mid so the way I like this it, it, it really hugs around your ankle pretty good and gives you that cushion and support you know like I said I'm not a fan of low tops but these really like hug your feet and uh, this little green tab here to help you know pull up uh, you got this little back here too uh, I don't know if it says anything I guess it says Nike I'm trying to read it for y'all but it says something back there I don't know if it says Nike or not little orange pull tab all this is uh, uh the foam material that they're talking about you know different color schematics uh and you're gripping back here and it's got a uh, little plastic design see if you can see it you know and it's got good gripping like i said it's got good gripping a lot of people said this resembles one of a either a kd version of a basketball shoe or, or, or a Kyrie, Kyrie, you know, resembles one of his shoes. You got the Nike swoosh only on the outside, and it feels like it's made out of uh, like plastic rubber, whatnot. I'm not sure what exactly the material is made out of, but uh, and then it's got a little bit of orange in it too, you know, and just the design and detail, you know, you can still see the, the, the purple material, uh, and then here feels like um feels like plastic right here but you know something for the for the aesthetic you know something for the eyes look at the design though all through there you know all around we got the nike swoosh here on the eyelids um they got a swoosh on one side and then it's got what is this uh zero zero one it looks like on this side and then on the inside it's got you can see that it's got like two two people talking you know y'all watch that and it's got a nike swoosh in there uh the color inside the inside the shoe sole the same color as this here um but yeah just the design of it is different you know like I said, uh, different color schemes, and it's very light, very light, and it has the, the word cosmic there. You know, overall, I give it a 10 for comfortability. And as far as the color wise, like I said, you know, y'all drop a comment, let me know. Uh, these ain't too bad color schemes, you know, color schematics, if you will. Uh, but, you know, as far as comfortability, I would wear these out on the court, you know, if it's gonna help me play and save and conserve energy by it being light 
uh, be able to do my best and give it my all, you know, and drop them threes and drive to the hole. You know, when everyone else is tired because they got those heavy gym shoes and I'll have these light ones or y'all will have these light ones. <laughs> so drop a comment. Let me know what y'all think about this uh, shoe review. If y'all would rock these, uh, definitely good. And, um, you know, like I said, price point 160. And, uh, you know, before I let y'all go, uh, zoom in behind the two shoes. What do these two look like from afar? What they look like? Y'all tell me. These two right here. Huh? Well, to me, they look like eyeball lids. You know, look like eyes. So I'm watching you, buddy. I'm watching you. <laughs> so I think that was pretty cool. It looks like eyes back here. I mean, that's just me. That's just something I noticed. Uh, and, uh, you know, Right here on the tongue, it says Nike Cosmic, and that's the you know, name of the shoe. And uh, like I said, lightweight material, at least 25% recyclable. Um, you know, that's all I got. You know, hopefully y'all like this video. I just thought I'd just drop a video. And also, too, real quick, I want to mention, I, I got a W today. Uh, some shoes dropped this week. Uh, the Colby Pro Troll 6 dropped this week. Uh, they're black and red. They sold out some Yeezys you know uh came out this week and then the ones that i wanted uh the retro threes georgetown dropped today and i actually got them so they'll be look out for for that review coming up pretty soon so um a lot of shoes been dropping i mean since this year uh there's too many to name but yeah um i'm very excited i got that w uh with that with that uh purchase you know i'll be reviewing that for you as soon as i get that in and uh you know, once again, you know, it's got the cosmic sign here. We got the swoosh there. So this is pretty cool. Pretty cool. You know. So uh, uh, tip of the day or quote of the day is enjoy every day like it's your last. Life is short. Love y'all. Be safe. And uh, drop a thumbs up again. And subscribe and hit that notification bell. Please share. And uh, until next time, till we meet. Love y'all.